Hello everyone. Okay, we come back to um, our unit chapter 11, unit 2. And today we can study unit 2. It tours of Uncle Wat. So in unit 1, we already learned something about uh, the history of Uncle. And now in unit 2, we go to a tour of Uncle Wat. Okay, in this unit, uh, we focus on reading skills, mean you practice your reading and to practice relative clauses and also to learn some new words. Okay, um, yesterday I posted a, a, te a, a, a text of a unit there, are, there were two pages and I hope you already read it and also um, look up for definition of the word that I gave you. Okay, before we go to the unit 2, we can review unit 1. In unit 1, we learn 10 words such as abandon, abandon, sanctuary, construction, currently, decline, generation, historical, Hindu, shape, and tower. So abandon means to leave something or to leave a place forever. Century means 100 years. Construction means the action of building something. And currently mean now in the present. And decline. Decline means decrease or become less and less. Generation is the same age. And historical referring to the histories. Hindu is one of the um, the religions. And shape, yeah, is a physical appearance, a physical form, and also a tower. And we learn past perfect. Yeah, past perfect is a tense that used in the past to identify two actions that happened in the past. And the action that happened first is the past perfect and the other is past simple. And also we learn conversation about Cambodian national symbol. So some of you, not all, and only grade, eight, uh, grade 11A who did it. Grade 11B, nobody did it. I don't know why. Only some of them did uh, uh, act out the uh, conversation and uh, post it in Google Classroom. And thank you so much for those who, who did and I'm sorry for those who didn't do it. Okay, our first word that I posted yesterday for you to check up before to check it out before today is the word base. You can look at the 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 phonetic symbol here we call base. Base base is mean the bottom of the bottom part of an object is base which is rests on the lowest part of something base example the crystal glass with a heavy base example before you build a house you have to build a base the base of the cliff of rock or beach base the bottom part in Khmer we say Mulatang example and another one, another word is builder. Builder is a person. If not a thing, it's a person. It's someone whose job is to make building. Someone who work to make building. A person that make or the person who make buildings. We call builder. Example. Um, when you want to build a house, you um, uh, you employ some builder to build your house. The synonym in the, the same word, the same meaning is constructor. And one more thing is column. Column, it is one of the several vertical blocks of print into page. Yeah, you know column, when you create a table, table like in, in the Excel, you have one, two three four columns and this one we call row so column is uh, several vertical blocks like one two three okay 
khlam and create create mean make also mean make create mean to make something new you know the word make very well right so create mean to make something new or invent something challenge to visit okay create mean to make something new example create facebook you can create facebook create facebook account create gmail account okay so create mean make and one more thing is formal formal is opposite of informal so formal mean public or official example formal procedures formal mean official I hope you understand this one and one more hi hi here if you delete e and t hi i think you know that word hi mean tall right but it's a noun so it is referring to the distance from the top to the bottom of something from the top to the bottom is a high example um my house is 10 meter high it means that from the bottom to the top is 10 meters okay so high referring to from the bottom the distance how far from the bottom to the top is so high and that's it is so easy right a very short lesson and this is all your work your work also very less work today is not very much only view the video and do the online test and that's it easy okay today i will post both lessons and the test at the same time because yesterday i didn't post any of the lesson just the textbook for you to read and now you can review the video and then you can do the test and let's review what we learned today is we learned some words already and also yeah mostly on on the words and next lesson it will be unit three sophie dream sophie dream and in that lesson we will study writing skills and the vocab that we we gonna study is the, the, the word break capable invent reality and sacrifice so if you have time you should check this before i teach you you should uh, look it up in dictionary first okay and then practice subordinate clause okay i think that's all for today and thank you so much for your time with you in this video i try to make it fast i try to make it um, short for you because i know that you might be very boring listen to the lesson yes i i can i can experience this too because you know i am so learning online recently so i can feel it thank you so much for the day thank you